Hi everyone, welcome back to Faith and Flower. If you're new here, my name is Robin, and in today's video, I am talking about my 10 item capsule wardrobe for fall 2021. Thanks so much for joining me here today. I love a capsule wardrobe, and there are lots of different approaches to how to do that, but the one that resonates with me the most is the 10 item wardrobe, and that was developed by Jennifer L. Scott over at The Daily Connoisseur. You can find out all the details of how to do a 10 item wardrobe in her books or over on her blog or YouTube channel, so I'll have those links down in the description box. So this fall, I have brought back some items from my previous fall wardrobes and other season wardrobes, plus a few new items that I wanna share with you today I'm really excited about. But before we get started, I wanted to let you know that today's video is in collaboration with my good friend Kay Harms over at Dress For My Day with Kay Harms. She has a YouTube channel and a blog by that name, and she's also a speaker and an author herself. So I met Kay, well over a year ago on YouTube, and she was fairly new to YouTube, but we did a collaboration last fall, and since then, her channel has taken off. Her blog was already very successful, and I knew that you guys were gonna love her on YouTube. So if you are not familiar with her yet, definitely check out her channel. I'm going to have her video for today linked down in the description box, so head over there and let her know that I sent you. And if you're coming from Kay's channel, I just want to give you a warm welcome. I mostly do homemaking inspiration here at Faith and Flower, and so I hope that you will like those videos. And I'm on here talking about fashion, usually about four times a year each season, when I talk about my 10 item wardrobe. So let's get started. The number 10 refers to the core pieces of your wardrobe, so the main components. So that will comprise pants, tops, skirts, or dresses. The number 10 is also meant to be a guide. So this is a number that's very flexible depending on your needs for the season. And as you can see, I have 11 core pieces for this fall. I have two pairs of jeans, one pair of pants, seven tops, and one dress. These first two pieces are a pleated v-neck tunic in dark red that comes from Amazon and also Amazon Essentials Women Slim Straight Fit Jeans in a Dark Wash. Both of these pieces are new to my wardrobe and I could not be happier with them. I love this top. It has long sleeves that can be pushed up with this tie tab so that it's a great transitional piece between the warmer and cooler weather that we're expecting in the fall. And the jeans are the perfect fit. They have just the right amount of stretch and I'm so happy with the quality of these pieces. It's not something that you would normally expect to get from Amazon, but the more I explored on Amazon, the more discoveries I made and quite a few of my pieces are from there including this third piece this crochet sleeve tunic top is a beautiful cut I love the fabric it's so comfortable and cool in the warmer months and will layer up great when it gets cooler here I'm wearing it again with the Amazon Essentials Slim Straight Fit Jeans and I've cuffed them to wear along with these ankle boots which I also found on Amazon. They are by Vionic. And I will have all the links down in the description box and all the Amazon pieces will also be in my Amazon store and you can find the link for that in the description box as well. The fourth core piece for this fall is this chiffon v-neck tunic, also from Amazon. This top has that tab sleeve detail, which I love, and I adore tunics. And as you'll see, this is pretty much what I'm sticking to in my tops for the fall. I love the length of a tunic because it looks elegant when you don't feel like tucking it in. And they couldn't be better for those of us that like a little coverage. The first two tops I showed you are in more traditional fall colors, that dark red and also the dark hunter green, which I love this time of year. Warm fall colors can be a little bit tricky for me. My color palette is a classic summer. 
So this cool sort of dusty blue is perfect for me. It's one of my favorite colors. And as you can see, <laughs> my fifth piece is also in a similar color. And although these are not traditional fall colors, I love wearing them, so it really works for me. This top is a Swiss dot top from Mod Pop. I love the Swiss dot detail and puff sleeves, and again, it's in that longer tunic length. This is something that I could easily wear in the spring and summer months, so I'm hoping to have this in my wardrobe for many seasons ahead. The sixth core item are these Mott & Bow mom jeans. So they are a high rise jeans. I am 5'9", so they are cropped on me with a 28 inch inseam. I love them for this time of year. I think they're a great transitional piece. And here you see I have it paired with of something that has been in my wardrobe for I don't even know how many seasons. It's a tab sleeve button down tunic. This one is from Chico's. I found a similar one which I linked below because this one is no longer available, but it's just a classic piece that keeps coming back because it looks great alone and it also layers perfectly under jackets and sweaters. Also new this season are two tops that I bought in two colors. I bought this puff sleeve tunic from Amazon. It's in black and it's made of a t-shirt material so it's very comfortable, but the cut, the v-neck and puff sleeve details really elevate it. And I have it paired with some cropped cargo pants that I have had in my wardrobe again for a very long time from Chico's and I have linked a similar one because those are no longer available. And and here is the same top in a black and white stripe. And if you know me, you know that I normally sort of stay away from black and I go more towards navy. But for the fall and winter time, I wanted to give it a try and so far I'm really loving those choices. If you are curious about my shoes, I will have all of those linked in the description box for you too. These are from Vivea and I am wearing them all the time. I've had them for several seasons now. They are made from recycled bottles and you would never know it. They are gorgeous, so comfortable, and come in lots of different colors and styles. I just have one dress this season and it is new to my wardrobe. In fact, I bought it at the end of the season last year on Nordstrom Rack. They have amazing offerings at really great prices. And this one is by London Times. And it's no longer available, but I did put the link to Nordstrom Rack and London Times down in the description box because you can find lots of similar styles there. I'm in love with this color. It's sort of a dark berry red, so it's got those cool undertones which work really well for me, but it still seems like fall. And because it's sort of an easy breezy dress, it's so comfortable to wear. Here I have it dressed up with some more shoes from Vivea. These are their kitten heel. And of course I had to throw on the cowgirl boots. <laughs> I am from Austin, Texas. So this is a look that I can definitely wear in the fall. That's it for the core pieces and now I'll show you a few of the extras that I've added for this fall. Starting with this graphic tee from Sadie and Jane. I love the graphic design, the cut of this t-shirt, and the material is so soft and comfortable. It's a great addition to my wardrobe this fall. And I was recently introduced to Sadie and Jane actually through Kay. They are a small family business that is dedicated to helping women feel confident sharing their faith. And they partner with brands that make an impact and help women from all over the world find freedom. Along with a t-shirt, they gifted me this gorgeous Faith Silver Bar necklace and it's from the Starfish Project. So each horizontal bar is engraved with faith, hope, love, and the classic starfish emblem. Starfish Project restores hope to trafficked women and girls through your purchase of their jewelry. I love Sadie and Jane. They are a great source for graphic tees, jewelry, journaling Bibles, tea towels, and more. I know you will love them too. You can find a link down in the description box along with my code Faith and Flower to receive 15% off your order. 
I also found this utility jacket or field jacket by Amazon Essentials and I'm very excited about it. It's such high quality at a very reasonable price. It's a very nice durable canvas fabric. I love all of the pockets and that you can cinch the waist. I've rolled up the sleeves and I think it looks amazing with this graphic tee. Kay showed one like it on her channel recently and I've been sort of obsessed ever since. So I was really happy to discover this on Amazon and I have had fun seeing how well it works with all of the pieces from my wardrobe this fall. I've had a lot of fun playing around with different looks. I like the slightly elevated dressy casual look on the left with the ankle boots and the very comfortable casual look on the right, perfect for going to a football game. I love these sneakers from Oliver Cabell. They are a little on the pricey side, but they are made of Italian leather and are the best quality. I know that they are going to last for many seasons to come. And what would fall be without a few cardigan sweaters in your wardrobe? They are wonderful for layering in the cooler evenings. And I found this one on Amazon. This cable knit is just a classic. And in this off-white color, it really pairs with everything in my wardrobe. So this is a piece that is not only high quality, but also something that I know I will never tire of. It's just a classic, something that I can bring back season after after season. To me, one of the best parts about the fall and even into the winter months is that I can use accessories like the jackets and the cardigan sweaters along with the shoes to really switch up my looks, create lots of different looks with only 10 or in my case 11 core pieces. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope that it gave you some tips and inspiration for how to put together a fall wardrobe of your own. And don't forget to check out Jennifer's channel if you want to know more about the 10 item wardrobe. I also want to thank Kay for doing this collaboration with me. It was a lot of fun. I always love working with Kay. And make sure you head over to her video, which I have linked down in the description box, and tell her I said hi. And if you're coming over from Kay's channel, thank you so much. Make sure that you subscribe before you leave. We'd love to have you join us here at Faith and Flower. Don't leave without giving the video a thumbs up. I really appreciate you spending your time with me here today. And I will see you down in the comments and in the next video. Until then, have a wonderful week.